Welcome back to Decorating with Kelly. Today, we will be exploring the world of maximalism. So make sure to like and subscribe and stick around to the end because I will be sharing with you some ways to personalize your space. Let's get started. The series on maximalism will be exploring the following, the origin and history, different styles and forms, including art deco and coastal, and today we will start with basic layering techniques and specific color scheme with maximalism in the bedroom. This internet love trend brings a little extra color to your sleep space. Here's how to try the look without disrupting the restfulness of your room. If you agree with Iris Atfell that more is more and less is a bore, and perhaps you even have that phrase embroidered on one of your many, many pillows, then we have some good news for you. Maximalist bedrooms are taking over TikTok with their fun, flare-filled designs. The bedroom is new territory for the ongoing resurgence of maximalist style, and we love seeing the application of bright colors and busy patterns in the typically neutral-filled bedroom. But why maximalism and why bedrooms? It really boils down to Sometimes you just need a good dose of fantasy and escapism, and there's no place more perfect to create a room that speaks to your wildest dreams than your bedroom. Plus, your bedroom is the perfect place to get your feet wet with this style. This is because you can create the essence of maximalism through bed linens, and since they are easy to swap out, you don't have to worry about a long-term commitment. Anthropology is the ideal place to explore bed linens. They have a multitude of coordinating patterns and styles. In addition, their accessories are perfect complements to creating a fabulous maximalism look. In building your layers, keep the following in mind. Find an inspiration piece, such as this duvet cover, to create your color palette. Make sure to vary the scale of the fabric and wallpaper prints. The use of solid colors give your eyes a place to rest in an otherwise busy room. Here are some tips in how to do maximalist style. Give the scheme longevity. Try and buy pieces that you personally resonate with, mark a special occasion, or pick up on your travels. It makes them extra special. Be mindful of what you already have. Keep pictures of the space on your phone so that you aren't too impulsive. Try and keep some kind of color scheme running through. It will make it more cohesive. Sherwin-Williams has the perfect tool to help you test out paint colors in your space. As you can see, these darker colors create a more moody vibe. Maximalist style incorporates layering in a way that looks well curated, bold, unapologetically colorful, pattern filled, and energetic. Maximalism is about surrounding yourself with the things that you love, including unique and eye catching finds. As you can see, I have swapped out some items on the bookshelf. This is to give you more inspiration for your own space. To personalize this space, I included the following family mementos. A handmade Polish stacking doll from my husband's grandparents. Childhood books that have been handed down through the generations. My husband's adorable baby shoes. And a beloved toy given to me by my father who was taken away at a young age. <music> 